It's so good to be worshiping with you. Um, this is a really bittersweet day for me. Um, it's exciting, but I just, I wanted to share with my church family that my husband and I um, will be moving to Houston, Texas this coming week. So this is my last Sunday here worshiping with you online. And it is so bittersweet because I just dearly love this church, my church family, and the job that I get to do here. Um, what a privilege and an honor that it has been to be here at St. Mark's Church the past several years. But it's so exciting because God has opened up a door for me and my husband, Devin, to serve together at a church in Houston, doing creative ministry together, um, which is what we, we are created to do. And we believe that we are best together. And so for the Lord to open a door, to answer a prayer that we've been praying for years is such an exciting blessing. So church, I just wanna say thank you for being so incredible, for being so loving, so welcoming to me, to my family as we've served here the past several years. And I just, as we go into this next time of worship, I just really wanna encourage you, because I know there are many, like I have been the past few years, You've been praying a prayer, begging God to do something, to move, to open a door. And there's probably a lot of you, so someone watching right now who feels like God isn't listening, that he's given up. But I just wanna encourage you, there's no other place, there's no better place to be than right in the center of God's will. God is a God of intentionality. He is a God of faithfulness. And he who has started a good work in you will not finish until that is completed. So hang on to what you're clinging to. Hang on to the truth. Hang on to God's faithfulness. We're gonna sing this song together and this has become really an anthem of my life that I let the spirit lead me, that we let him take control because there's no other way to live. So would you just worship with us?